Okay, good morning to all. Myself, Mr. Khan, and today we are going to continue our third part of introduction to mechatronics. Already, many two parts covered kar chuka introduction to mechatronics. That is uh, first 1.1 introduction to mechatronics, in which we have seen key elements of mechatronics. And in 1.2 introduction to mechatronics, we have seen mechatronics system in factory, home, and business application. If you have not seen videos, so before proceeding 1.3. पार्ट में पहले आप 1.1 और 1.2 देख लें यहां पे लिंक अवेलेबल है यहां पे क्लिक करके आप वो दोनों वीडियो देख लें नाउ लास्ट थिंग रिगार्डिंग सब्सक्राइबर्स प्लीज अगर आप चाहते कि मैं और ऐसे वीडियो अपलोड करूं फॉर मोटिवेशनल पर्पस प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल बाय क्लिकिंग ओवर हियर यहां पे प्लीज सब्सक्राइब कीजिए और जिससे मुझे और मोटिवेशन मिले और मैं ऐसे और वीडियोस अदर सब्जेक्ट्स पे के भी रिलेटेड विद मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग में अपलोड कर सकूं नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट the in the introduction of mechatronics as i said in the introduction of this series i am going to cover this much point usme se key element of mechatronics mein already cover kar chuka hu agar aapne nahi dekha hoga to again you can click over here 1.1 introduction to mechatronics to aap wo pehla video dekh sakte hain aur mechatronics system in factory home and business application ye 1.2 mein maine cover kiya hai agar aapne abhi tak nahi dekha hai to yahan pe aap click karke ke 1.2 introduction to mechatronics pe jaake ye part bhi aap wahan pe cover kar sakte hain and in this video i'm going to cover the basic component of mechatronic system and objective and advantages of mechatronic system as this bit is very small basic component of mechatronic because of that i'm merging the last second last and last point and mechatronic design process i'm go, going to cover at the last part that is 1.4 introduction to mechatronics a bis 1.3 mein hum just basic component of mechatronic system objective is advantage of mechatronic system dekhi then let's start with the basic components of mechatronic system then basic component of mechatronic system in which first we are controlling the mechanical part because of that i'm saying the mechanical system has at its core a mechanical system which need to be commanded and controlled matlab mechatronic system hota kya hai ek mechanical system hota hai jisko hame control command karna hai uske liye hame ek mechatronic system design karte hai to core element kya hai mechanical system jise hame control karna hai then that might be व्हीकल ब्रेकिंग सिस्टम या माइट बी ए पोजिशनिंग टेबल ओ हो सकता है असेंबली मशीन हो सकता है वो मैकेनिक सिस्टम कुछ भी हो सकता है जिसे हमें कंट्रोल या कमांड करना देन बिफोर टू कंट्रोल एंड कमांड आई रिक्वायर्ड व्हाट इज द स्टेट ऑफ द सिस्टम व्हाट एग्जैक्टली वी नीड टू प्रोवाइड द कंट्रोलर नीड टू पास द इन्फॉर्मेशन रिगार्डिंग द स्टेट ऑफ द इन्फॉर्मेशन टू प्रोवाइड द स्टेट ऑफ द इन्फॉर्मेशन पहले हमें उसके इन्फॉर्मेशन रिट्राइव करना होगा फॉर मैकेनिकल सिस्टम फॉर दैट आई रिक्वायर्ड sensors the controller need information about the state of the system as i said for the card required sensor wo sensor might be proximity sensor ho sakta hai velocity sensor ho sakta hai temperature sensor displacement information sensor ultronic sensor many sensors are there according requirement hame wo sensors wahan pe implement karna hai by which i am getting a signal of the state of the system then whatever the signal generated by the sensor the signal produced by the sensor are not in form to read by uh, ready to read by the controller why because the signal might be the noise will be there might be the magnitude is very small is there for that I, initially i need to do signal conditioning to hame signal conditioning initially karna padega that it signal conditioning is also called as amplification also some stack agar humne magnitude increase kar to amplify kar rahe hain and that's also comes under the signal conditioning part then here after whatever the state traced by the sensor and after signal conditioning it is in an analog form the signal then i need to convert this signal analog to digital form. and after conversion on digital form then and then only i am able to present this information or this signal to controller what is a controller controller is a mind of mechatronic system which process user command and send signal which process user command means controller माइट बी विद ऑफ दिस सेंसर जो भी हमने सेंसर सेंस किया ऐसे भी वो कमांड जनरेट कर सकता है और माइट बी विद ऑफ यूजर ऑल्सो आई कैन इंटरफेस ओवर यू एंड आई कैन चेक दिस वैल्यू हाउ मच वैल्यू गेटिंग एंड अकॉर्डिंग टू डेट आई कैन जनरेट द कमांड विच प्रोसेस यूजर कमांड एंड सेंस सिग्नल टू जनरेट कमांड सिग्नल टू टू बी सेंड टू द एक्चुएटर वट इज एक्चुएटर वी विल सी दफ्टरवर्ड तो अल्टीमेटली यूजर का काम क्या होता है या कंट्रोल का काम क्या होता है सिग्नल सेंस करके रिक्वायर्ड टास्क परफॉर्म करना विद हेल्प ऑफ एक्चुएटर then here we send the signal we conditional the signal means amplify the signal we convert analog to digital and we got the information now 
we convert the digital form because the controller understand the digital form then here controller whatever the signal generated by the controller it's also in the digital form matlab jo bhi controller generate karega signal wo bhi digital form mein hoga correct because controller ko digital language hi samajh mein aata hai he never understand the analog form then whatever the command generated by the controller first i need to convert digital to analog because at the end actuator is there aur main actuator analog signal samajhta hai digital signal he never understand so whatever the signal generated by the controller in digital form i need to convert to analog form and that i will pass to the driver circuit what is the driver circuit the command signal to be actuator are first converted from the digital to analog form and amplify implement in the form of driver circuit driver circuit jo amplify karta hai usko also can be used to amplify the command signal set to the actuator means driver circuit ultimately amplification karega yahan pe ke samne amplify kiya tha signal conditioning mein then same way driver circuit amplify the signal yeah सिग्नल इट शुड बी इन द फॉर्म बाई विच एक्चुएटर कैन अंडरस्टैंड दैट इज अ ड्राइवर सर्किट इन अनदर वे लैंग्वेज नो दैट सिग्नल आई एम सेंडिंग टू एक्चुएटर वॉज इट वॉट इज एक्चुएटर एक्चुएटर इज द मैकेनिज्म दैट कन्वर्ट्स इलेक्ट्रिकल सिग्नल इन टू यूजफुल मैकेनिकल मोशन और एक्शन मतलब जो भी मैकेनिकल मोशन जनरेट करना है मुझे अल्टीमेटली मैकेनिकल सिस्टम है तो डेफिनेटली मुझे मैकेनिकल मोशन जनरेट करना है Here controller, I'm getting only electrical energy, electrical signal by which I'm never produce the mechanical motion. Because of that, I required actuator. Like various actuators are there, like servo motor, stepper motor, in electric electrical actuator, uh, uh, stepper motor, and pneumatic hydraulic. That we will see in detail in next series. But just right, just right now, keep in your mind what is actuator. Actuator is the mechanism that converts electrical signal into useful mechanical motion and action. and finally with the help of this actuator i am getting the desired task or desired operation in mechanical system this are the basic components of mechatronic system koi bhi aap mechatronic system le lijiye ye aapko components basic milenge hi milenge without this we never say the mechatronic system is completed like in a, my previous video in 1.2 i covered the basic application of mechatronic system factory home and business appliances then in factories mein i am taking the example of robotic arm then in that case robotic arm the motion whatever the motion i need to achieve might be welding welding samjho welding welding operation complete karna then that is a mechanical system then to run the mechanical link the mechanical link is suppose i want to move a conductor to perform the welding operation for that i need to sense the state of the signal what is the angle of that signal for that i use a feedback sensor agar aapko yaad hoga aapko nahi yaad hoga to aap jaake aur ek baar mera video 1.2 introduction of electronics dekh lijiye usme humne discuss kiya feedback sensor is there सेंसर वो सेंस करेगा फिर हम उसको एम्पलीफाई करेंगे देन आई एम सेंडिंग द कंट्रोलर 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 अंडरस्टैंड द सिग्नल एंड इट सेंड द सिग्नल टू द एक्चुएटर एंड इन दैट केस एक्चुएटर इज सर्वो मोटर ओके नेक्स्ट एग्जांपल आई टुक एज अ डिजिटल थर्मोमीटर थर्मोमीटर के केस में क्या था एग्जाम्पल थर्मोमीटर के केस में हमने मैकेनिकल सिस्टम था टेम्परेचर दैट आई नीड टू सेंस दैन आई एम यूजिंग द सेंसर एज अ थर्मो कपल देन एम्पलीफायर इज देयर एन एन लॉक टू डिजिटल कन्वर्टर इज देयर एंड आफ्टर डेट I don't think so. I am using any kind of actuator in that case, but we am going to display that signal. That again is a part of mechatronic system. Now let's move to the next part. Objective. What are the objective? The primary objective of mechatronic system is to integrate the mechanical system with electrical, electronic, and computer system. Integrate करना है electrical, electronic, and computer with mechanical system, and provide multi-disciplinary approach to product development and manufacturing system and design. That is the primary objective of mechatronic system. Other objectives are there that also we call as a secondary objective to improve the efficiency of the system, to reduce the cost of the system, to achieve higher precision and accuracy for easy control of system. customer satisfaction comfort these are the secondary objective but primary objective is to is to integrate the mechanical system with electrical and electronic and computer system and provide multidisciplinary approach to product development and manufacturing system and design okay and last part what are the advantage of mechatronic system first advantage is the product are cost effective and of very good quality jo bhi product mein generate kar raha hu wo cost effective hoga i am getting in the proper cost and quality bhi high rahegi jo bhi main produce kar raha hu with mechatronic system the performance characteristics of mechatronic product are very difficult to achieve without synergistic combination agar main bina synergistic combine nahi karta to wo jo performance mein achieve kar raha without mechatronic it is quite difficult to achieve without the synergistic combination high degree of flexibility means what according to condition jahan pe bhi hum mujhe implement karna hai wahan pe easily i can implement the mechatronic system according to i need to changes i need to program aur us hisab se wo change kar lega apne aap ko greater extent of machine utilization material installation zyada hota hai isme or owing to the incorporation of intelligent 
सेल्फ करेक्टिंग सेंसर एंड फीडबैक सेंसर द मेकाट्रॉनिक्स अप्रोच रिजल्ट इन ग्रेटर प्रोडक्टिविटी हायर क्वांटिटी एंड प्रोड्यूसिंग रिलायबिलिटी दैट आर द एडवांटेज ऑफ मेकाट्रॉनिक सिस्टम अगेन फॉर दिस वीडियो आई रेफर द मेकाट्रॉनिक सिस्टम डिजाइन सेटी एंड कोग सेंड्रेज लर्निंग इंडियन एडिशन बुक यू कैन रेफर अनदर बुक ऑल्सो बट आई रेफर दिस बुक टू कंप्लीट दिस बेसिक कंपोनेंट ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड एडवांटेज ऑफ मेकाट्रॉनिक सिस्टम थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच आफ्टर दिस वीडियो एज आई सेड इन द लास्ट वीडियो यू कैन अपेयर फॉर दिस टेस्ट just go through the test and check what how much knowledge you uh, gain with the help of this video suppose if you are getting less marks less than 40% then i think so you need to rewatch this video and again appear the test if suppose if you are getting more than 80% or 70% okay then no necessary to appear the test you are getting exactly what i am explaining and just wait for the next video for next video update please subscribe my channel subscription button is over here and uh, अगर आपने अभी तक मेरा प्रीवियस वीडियो नहीं देखा है तो तो क्लिक हियर 1.1 पॉइंट वन इंट्रोशन टू मैकेट्रॉनिक्स एंड फॉर सेकंड वीडियो 1.2 पॉइंट टू इंट्रोशन टू मैकेट्रॉनिक्स क्लिक हियर ओके एंड डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल प्लीज प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल टू मोटिवेट मी टू अपलोड मोर सस्टाइप वीडियो थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच सी यू सुन बाय बाय टेक केयर